How's it going, everyone? I've uh, been wanting to do this video for quite some time. Uh, this is a cabinet shootout. Uh, years ago, when I first bought my my first real high quality guitar cabinet, I really didn't know what to get. I'd asked a bunch of people and nobody would really give me a straight answer. And there certainly weren't any uh, samples for me to check out. Uh, so what I've done is I've gathered five very high quality guitar cabinets, mic them all with the same amp, same mic, same settings, same everything, and just changed out the cabinet. And um, I'll let you guys make an informed decision based on what you hear. This is a blind test. I'm not gonna tell you guys what cabinets what, all the results will be put up at the end of the video. Um, I'd like to thank Brandon Wright for lending me uh, some of his cabinets, uh, as well as Chris Rafinski. And um, so what we've put together here is a Mesa Oversized, a Mesa 2x12, a uh, Marshall 1960, and as well as a Marshall 1960V, and an Angle Pro Cab. All those cabinets are loaded with Celestian Vintage 30s, with the exception of the Marshall 1960, which is loaded with Celestian DT75s. Let's get right to it. And because you guys always ask for this, here are the guitar tracks soloed up. Now, one thing to keep in mind when you're choosing a guitar cabinet is uh, what is it gonna be used for? I mean, like, cause a four x 12 is a lot of equipment to haul around. If you're pl playing small gigs, maybe a two x 12 will work better for you. Um, the Mesa cabinet is amazing. It's huge though. Uh, whereas the angle cab's a little smaller, but honestly weighs about a third more than the, than the Mesa cab does because it uses thicker wood. What really blows me away about this is just how much a difference of tone there is from cabinet to cabinet, even though they're using the same speakers. It's all in the construction. It's all how the sound uh, works with the grill in the front. So it just goes to show just changing out the wood, changing out um, certain certain construction dimensions can really affect your tone. And um, I've always thought, you know, the, the easiest way to affect your guitar sound is actually change out the speakers because that's where the sound is coming from. So I hope you guys get some use out of this. Like I said, I tried to keep this test as neutral as possible and just let you guys hear the difference from cabinet to cabinet. If you know somebody who's in the market for a four by 12, um, please send them this video and please let me know if you guys enjoyed this shootout because I will do more. Leave a comment below. Tell me what you think. Tell me what uh, cabinet you liked best. Here's the results.